What's up guys, this is your host Cody, and today I gotta break some news to you. Becoming an advanced player that can be competitive in Fortnite isn't easy. Many players tend to have trouble improving and staying consistent once they have improved. One of the main problems that people tend to run into is their aiming. Players can more easily train their building, editing, and movement, but aiming takes a lot of accuracy and consistency. In addition to this, the shotgun in Fortnite is one of the most important weapons for success. Many of the engagements that happen during games are close quarters and will usually result in some sort of build fighting. The most popular weapon of choice during build fights is also the shotgun because of its effectiveness. The shotgun can deal great amounts of damage in close quarters while also being versatile and great for mobility as it pulls out fast. All of this makes the shotgun a great weapon of choice. So if you want to learn how to master the shotgun, head over to ProGuides.com where you can get your own personal coach who will guide you through the learning process. We even have courses from pro players like Benji and Mongrel. So if you want structure in learning Fortnite, check us out on ProGuides.com. Shotguns tend to have a large spread. This spread can be larger than what you normally see on other weapons. The problem this causes is that many people will tend to think that getting just a part of that reticle on the opponent will be enough. But the fact of the matter is that you need to be able to hit high damage shots with the shotgun. Chances are, if you're shooting at someone with the shotgun, they're going to be shooting back. And a lot of times, this will cause you to do lower damage than your opponent when trading off shots. This is where a lot of people will complain about getting low damage output when compared to the person they're fighting. But at the end of the day, it's truly their fault for not lining up the shot. So how can you do a better job of lining up that reticle and hitting for maximum damage? Let me tell ya. Well, the first thing you can do is focus more on the center reticle that you have conveniently in the center of your screen. That small dot is the best thing to use for lining up shots. Not only is it directly in the center, but it's also located in a way where the X spread of the shotgun pellets will be lined up perfectly. Shotguns have a mechanic where their damage output is based on an X-shaped crosshair. It's oftentimes hard to maximize damage with this crosshair, but by lining up the center dot with the half point of an opponent's head or body, you can actually maximize the amount of damage you can do from the distance you're at. To explain this in the simplest way possible, you want to line up your reticle while getting as close as possible to your opponent's middle section. Now let's move on to some more necessary tips. With the removal of the classic aim assist with the introduction of advanced aiming, we found a big change in aiming mechanics in the game. You can no longer lock onto opponents by just simply pressing the left trigger multiple times. You now have to actually line up your shots manually and you don't get the same benefit from left trigger. But you do have one very underrated trick that not a lot of people use. Regardless of whether or not you even use aim assist, ADSing or zooming in while you're using a shotgun will effectively decrease the spread and increase the accuracy of the weapon. This is because of the aiming mechanics that Epic has implemented into Fortnite. Every time you pull your left trigger, you're essentially tightening your reticle and making your weapon spread much shorter. This can make a huge difference in damage numbers. However, this trick is only useful when you have your feet on the ground. So consider getting used to pressing your left trigger before shots when you're grounded. This will significantly improve the damage output of every single one of your shots. Now for the times when you're not actually on the ground, a great tip we have for you guys is utilizing the surface area of Fortnite characters. Let's say that you're in the air after a jump and you're going for a shotgun shot while being a good distance away from your opponent. Instead of doing what most people do, which is aiming for the head, you want to aim for the body because this provides a larger area at which your pellets can connect. Remember, the shotgun's damage isn't solely based off where your pellets connect, but also how many of them connect from each shot. Your sensitivity is probably the most important aspect to every part of your gameplay when it comes to aiming. You will not be able to do good damage if you're not aiming well, and it's not possible to aim well without a good sensitivity you're comfortable with. So let's take a short trip down sensitivity lane and think about some of the best sensitivities you guys can use to get an edge. To start with an all-around good sensitivity, we suggest that you guys go and watch our latest advanced sensitivity video. In this video, we talk about which sensitivity we believe to be the best, and we make this decision based on watching many pros and seeing how they perform. So be sure to do this before continuing with the rest of the video. Now let's talk about optimizing your sensitivity. In order to aim better, you need to take the sensitivity we give you and optimize it in a way where you can actually make it perfect for you. You can start doing this by entering a public match or a custom game where you can practice your shotgun shots while getting engaged into real fights. We suggest going into creative mode and playing 1v1s against a friend. 
Next, you want to perfect your sensitivity by trial and error. If you find yourself turning too fast or turning too slow, you'll want to adjust the sensitivity based on your needs. If you tend to overcompensate when you aim, just lower the turning speed until you feel more comfortable. By optimizing your sensitivity this way, you're getting even closer to perfecting your aim. Now let's get into another concept of shotgun aiming known as the pre-fire. Pre-firing or pre-aiming is a concept that has been in gaming since the first FPS shooter came out. The whole concept behind this trick is aiming where your opponent will be before they're actually there. To give you guys an example, let's say that you're in a build fight where you and your opponent are running towards each other from a corner. Now you know that your opponent will be emerging from a general area. In order to maximize your chances of hitting that first shot, you want to have your aim directly where you think that person will be located when you initially see them. Getting the first shot off accurately can make a world of a difference. But more importantly, pre-aiming can be used in many different scenarios, not just corner shots. Even in very fast-paced build fights where you and opponent are spraying your builds out and going guns blazing with shotguns, you need to know the approximate location of your opponent. And you can do this by having good awareness and basically paying attention to where your opponent is located at all times. If you're going to take a jump shot or create an angle, be ready to fire as soon as you see the opponent. And then quickly throw up builds and make sure you're not taking damage in return. Doing this effectively can make a world of a difference in all fights. Pre-aiming is a critical aspect to all shooters, and you need to be able to improve at it and make it a part of your gameplay if you want to improve at a fast and consistent rate. This is a skill that you definitely want to have, so make sure you're learning and practicing it. Consider watching some pros, as almost every pro in Fortnite does it. You can literally pick any pro and you'll see them doing it. So now you know how important shotgun skills and aiming are to your chances of becoming a top-tier Fortnite player. And hopefully this makes you want to practice it, right? Practicing anything will make you much better at it. And this applies very extremely in Fortnite. In Fortnite, there are so many different types of mechanics that you must master. The more you play and practice, the better you will become at it. So let's go over some of the best ways you can practice. Starting off, we want to show you guys a shotgun aim training course that provides an in-game shotgun aim trainer. The map code for this is 553-11890-2291. Go into creative and plug in this map code and you guys will be set to practice. By playing this aim training course, you're essentially practicing the aiming mechanics that you need in order to improve at aiming with your shotgun. Specifically muscle memory and being able to aim based off sheer skill instead of just coordination and timing. Muscle memory is a great thing to have in games like Fortnite and it is absolutely necessary at the pro level. You're going to need to be able to focus on more important things than just aiming when you're in stacked matches against some of the best players in the world. So we suggest spending at least 20 to 30 minutes a day playing this course and practicing to make your aim better. Next we have another method for practicing that is a bit more fun and practical. This is jumping into a creative world with your friends and 1v1ing with shotguns only. Playing like this will greatly train not only your shotgun aim, but also your overall shotgun play, meaning the speed at which you can effectively time shotgun pullouts, different areas where you shoot from different distances, and just overall shotgun efficiency. We definitely recommend practicing shotgun gameplay in 1v1s, as we want you guys to get the most effective practice possible. In summary, you guys want to practice your shotguns greatly. It's a very important weapon and many of your fights are going to depend on it. Our best tips are going to be to focus on lining up your shots with great emphasis on the center reticle. Secondly, make sure that you're using your ADS to reduce reticle size, and really focus on knowing whether or not it's the right time to be aiming for the head or for the body. We suggest watching our best sensitivity video and adjusting that sensitivity to your specific needs. Finally, spending time in creative practicing to perfect your talents and accuracy is important. Use the map code we provided and don't forget to invite your most skilled friend for some friendly 1v1s. Using our tips in 1v1s, you'll be outplaying and dominating your friends in no time. And with some practice, you can even get a shot to perform at the highest level and win some cash in the next Fortnite events. All right, all right, all right, guys. That's it for today's video. We hope you enjoyed. Comment down below what you thought and what you'd like to see next. We strive to bring you guys daily quality content, so do us a favor by liking this video, subscribing to the channel, and show ProGuides.com some love for bringing you to this video. Thanks for watching. Once again, it's your host, Cody, and peace out. See you on the next one.